Hey you all, what's going on? It's your girl J Prissy, and yes, your girl has her water. Did I sound so greedy right there? My bad. I just want to say that I hope you all had a great day, great weekend. If you notice, yes, your girl still got on this shirt. I'm pumping out these videos for you all because I have a busy week and I know you all too and I don't want to backslide and I get these videos out to you J loves I'm trying my best so if you're new to the channel please hit that subscribe button if I haven't said that yet everyone click those likes up button ring my bell honey and let's move forward did I say that thumbs up too yes and also, I am really trying to grow the channel to 2,000 subscribers. Once I hit that 2,000 subscribers, your girl is going to do a, what, a giveaway. So, that's what I want to leave you all with that. So, let's just get into it. It is about how to raise your vibration. And the reason why I'm bringing this up, because I have been talking about the law of attraction. That's something that I'm into. You know, I have talked about the secret. If you haven't watched those other previous videos please um look at them and let me know what you think i just believe that um raising your vibration is it's nothing but energy you know and what i know is that when i'm telling myself something bad oftentimes we play all of this crap in our heads all this negative things or whatever because you know sometimes you feel like you're not where you want to be in life you feel like oh this not working out or your bills and all of these things and everything else that all of that is just depositing more more and more negative energy in you before you know it you're feeling depressed or your vibration is very often nothing is going right so what i notice is that first of all i try to check myself i do inventory in so many words because when i'm like okay why am i thinking all this hold on stop okay so when i another negative negative comment come in my mind or let me say idea whatever you want to say um like this for instance let's just say example oh girl today been a rough day it's been so hard traffic and all of this crap getting to work just hard okay that's a lot okay I'm mentioning traffic. I mentioned that today is a hard day. It's a lot going on at work. Okay, those are three. So let me take those three and turn them into positives. You know what? Today is going to be a good day. Even though it was hard at first, but it's shifting to a better, uh, in a better place. Look outside. Oh, look at the sky. It's really nice. It's blue. It's sharp. And I got all my fingers. I just started doing things like that. And I started giving gratitude. Like, you know what? Thank God I got my toes because everybody ain't got toes. Thank God I got my fingers and I got my ear to listen. When you can't think about, you know, something positive or whatever, just start thinking about the things you're grateful for. And then it started to roll with you like, you know what? After all, it's going to be a good day because somebody laying in the hospital and I'm able to shift and I'm able to move. So that's another thing. Part two, um, step two or however you want to say is that you got to get your body moving. Whatever your favorite song is, whatever your anthem is, you need to play that. I sometimes, I be in my mood, so I try to start off with something inspirational. And that's just for me. Inspirational music, it gets me. Old gospel music, it gets me. Donna Lawrence, he gets me. And he gets me to be shifting in a positive way. So it's like I like to start off with that, and then later on I start with the other secular music. Because that's just how I roll. Nothing against anybody, but that's just what works for me, you know? So, and my, I guess my third thing is also sometimes take a minute from yourself. And, I, oh, I'm going to leave that as a fourth one. The third thing I would do a lot of times is I light a candle. I don't care. I don't care if it's 12 o'clock in the uh, evening. I'm still going to light me a candle. I love taking candlelight baths and showers. I don't care. It ain't got to be nobody now but me with a little music. Having a candle burning, it just sets my tone. It sets my tone. It sets my mood. And I don't know what it is about the cleansing of 
uh, the shower for me, the bath, especially a shower, is very powerful for me. It just kind of boosts my energy a little bit. And sometimes I can't have it too high because it's going to disrupt my mood. Because I do like taking hot showers. But when I'm feeling down and out of everything else, I like it to be warm. And then once I clean my body off like a, like a hot warm or something like that, I don't know, like that in between, really good. But then I shift into... A little coolness and why the reason why I do that because it shifts my mind that hey I'm on an island and I'm under a waterfall and that's what I like to do and it just really puts me in a better mood I don't feel sluggish anymore I'm up I got I'm energized water does that I mean we're made what so many percentage of what I would like 70% or something I don't know I'm not that scientific but water works well with us I'm just telling you Try it out in a candle too. So, and my next thing is my, I think that was my third one. So my fourth one would be, is I love to, if everything on me is just chaotic, what I like to do is stop thinking about the chaotic, chaotic world that I'm in. But at times I like to just focus on my friends and family. Whatever it is that they need me to do, I always say, it's time for me to do an act of kindness. And a lot of things have been going on. A lot of different challenges have been facing my way. And if you follow me on Snapchat, and those who follow me on Snapchat, well, what? Thank you. But um, what I like to do, like this weekend, it was hell. Um, it really wasn't hell. It was hell getting to where I was going. But this week has been a really sh tough one for me. So I was like, you know what, I'm going to go visit my cousin. And my cousin was like, she's going to cook for me some wings and everything else. You know, I love wings and stuff, especially ranch wings. Ooh, they are so delicious. So I was like, well, while I'm going over there, I never like to go somewhere and I haven't seen somebody in a very long time and stuff. That's just me. I like to give them something. So I gave her a few things from my haul. And she really loved it. She really appreciated it. And it made me more happier that I was able to give her something. And she really enjoyed it. So that's what I want to leave you all with. Is that, you know, sometimes just take a moment. Do an act of kindness. Sometimes take a shower. Think positive. Feel good. Smell good. That way you can create better things. And if you all would like um, to share with me some of the things that you do to shift your vibration to a high level, to a positive level, please share with me. And um, I don't mind trying it out. And I guess that's it. I'm not going to keep you out any longer. And also, if you haven't watched the Dollar Tree haul of those snacks, please get into it and let me know what you think. And I shall be gone. If I did mention, but well, I said I shall be gone. But if I did mention the 2,000 subscribers, which I think I did, just remember, I'm trying to grow the channel. Please help your girl out. And I guess that's it. I'm going to leave you all with that. And thank you all so much. I holla. Bye-bye.